we've got to bring the parents out and make them understand. To think that parents would do this to their own flesh and blood. Let them die alone, knowing they're going through this illness. Sylvia was incredibly energetic and vibrant. She was a force to be reckoned with. She was very busy putting out leaflets and going to Barnes and Nobles and going to independent bookstores and going to synagogues and going to churches and retirement centers and spreading her word of love your children, even if they're gay, learn to deal with it. She knew she was making a big impact by talking to all these people and getting her book out in the world. But she also wanted to make sure those books were in libraries. And what I did was go to the library and try to learn and educate myself. And what I want my book to do, make the world, everyone in this world aware of what a horrible thing this AIDS is, that we must give and support the research for it, because otherwise the world, all our young are going to be gone. The power of the archives is a very strong antidote to the forces of society that want to make some people invisible.